So hi, we meet again in Optometry Week. So today we're going to look for an amplitude of accommodation test. HR pull away and push up method. So first of all, let me tell you the purpose of this test. So the purpose of this test is to measure the full range of accommodation. Where from the far point where accommodation is relaxed and the near point where accommodation is fully exerted. So, Let's take a look to the procedure. Okay, for the amplitude of accommodation test, we're going to apply two methods, which is push-up method and also pull-away method. For the push-up method, what you have to do is, first of all, you put this RAF ruler in front of your patient and what you need to do is, you need to push the target towards the patient until they report blur. Once they say it's blur, then it could, that point going to be their first near point accommodation. Okay, so, so for this, we are applying push-up method. Okay. For the pull-away method, what you're going to do is, once the patient reports this target become blurry, you need to push the target backwards again until they report it's clear. So this is going to be your second near point of accommodation. So in order for you to know the real amplitude of accommodation of the patient, so what you need to do is, you need to take the middle dioptric reading between the first near point accommodation that you obtain through push up method and also the near point accommodation point that you got from your pull away method. Hello, now let us see the procedure for the amplitude of accommodation test. Before proceeding with the procedure, first make sure you have to do some setup. First of all, make sure the brightness of your room light is enough for the test. Second, make sure your patient is wearing their habitual. Let's say here my patient is already wearing their habitual spectacles. So you can do the test using their habitual spectacles. Okay, next, make sure you are get ready with your instrument. So for this test, we need instrument which is rough root and also an occluder to occlude the patient's eye. So now, let us start the test. Okay, now I'm going to do amplitude of accommodation test on you. Okay, the purpose of this test is to measure the focusing power of your eye. Okay, okay. so can you just follow my instructions? Um, okay, okay. Okay, now can you hold this? Okay, and can you close your left eye? Yes. Okay, close your left eye. Okay, that's right. Now I'm going to put this in front of you. Can you close your eyes? Okay. So now, can you read this line? Custom on the first day of every. Okay, that's good. So now, can you read the word every? Yes. Okay. So now, I'm going to push this shirt in front of you. So do let me know when the word every become blurry. Okay, can okay. you do that? I can do that. Okay, thank you. So Welcome. I'm going to push this. Just focus on the word every. So now, let's do for your left eye. Okay, can you hold this on your right eye position? Okay, close your right eye. Okay, let's go. Okay. okay, the same thing. Okay, can you look the word custom yet? Yes. Okay, so the same thing. I'm going to push this in front. So do let me know when you see it very okay. Stop. Okay, wait. Open your eyes. Is this still blurry? 
Yeah, uh, no, it's clear. Okay, so I'm going to push it in front of you and let me know when it's blurry. Stop. Can you lean again? Is it still blurry? Uh, it's clear. It's clear. Okay, I will push it in front again. Okay. Let me know when it's blurry. Stop. Okay. Is it still blurry? Blink your eyes. Ah, it's blurry. It's blurry already. Okay, so the same thing. I'm going to push it backwards. Let me know when it becomes clear. Clear. Clear already. Oh, okay. okay, that's good. Now we're gonna do this test for both eyes. Okay. So now, can you look at the wood first? Yes. Yes, you can see, right? So the same thing. I'm gonna push it in front. Focus on the wood first to let me know when it becomes blur. Okay. Stop. Blink your eyes. Open. Is it still blur? Uh, it's clear. Okay, I'll push it in front again, let me know when it's blur. Stop. Okay, is it blink your eyes? Is it blur? Uh, yes. Okay, I'll push it backwards again, let me know when it becomes clear. It's clear. It's clear now. Okay, it's clear. Okay, once you finish doing the test on your patient, you need to record all the three dioptric readings for all the three conditions, which is for monocular, right and left eye, and also for the both eyes. So what you need to do is you need to calculate the average of the three readings and come up with one average reading. And this reading is going to be the amplitude of accommodation for your patient. Thank you. Okay, now we proceed with the tones and those to get the accurate result for this test. Okay. Uh, I think okay. Can you see the word happy? Oh, yes. Your left eye. Okay, thank you. Uh, and then I will push this forward. And can you see the words cluster? Yes. Okay. Focus at the, uh, at the words. Can you please close your left eye? Okay, and uh, then you focus at the word every. Okay, let's start our test. On our perspective, our perspective. Okay, check the wall. Now, let's look at the other variations to conduct this test.
Clear. Clear. Yes. Okay, that's good.